Hi everybody, this is Richard White and I'm going to show you real quickly how you can set up an email for a recurring event in Google Calendar. I'm looking at this Learn AP Physics website and they used to send out emails but now they're not going to do that anymore. They're going to use Twitter for that. So um, I still like getting the emails so what I'm going to do is I'm going to use my Google Calendar here. You need to associate your recurring events with some sort of calendar just to keep things nice and clean. I'm actually going to create a new calendar for this and I'm going to call it uh, Learn AP Physics. And so that'll be the new calendar here. Um, and create calendar. And I should see a little calendar creation here in just a moment. Uh, that Learn AP Physics, there it is right now, there it is. Uh, I'm going to create a, an event now that's going to recur in that Learn AP Physics calendar. So let me create a new untitled event here. I'm going to associate it with Learn AP Physics. That's the calendar that I like. And I'm going to use here the URL of that web page. And very specifically, it's the problem.php. And I want to be reminded of this every weekday. We'll start on, uh, well, actually, I think it's not going to start up until August 15th, so I'll have that be the starting day. Uh, and I want to get this email. Um, I'm going to have this event and get this email every morning, let's say, oh, I don't know, 6 in the morning. Uh, I'll make it a very short event here. Uh, we'll change it to 6.15 here, so it won't take up too much space on my calendar. And I want to repeat this event, so I'm going to repeat it, what, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. I want to go every week all those weekdays because that's how those things are delivered and um, do I have some sort of I guess I want to repeat it yeah every week I want to do that starting on the 15th and keep on going until the end of the school year so uh, when's the end of the school year probably sometime around June 15th maybe I'm gonna have this reminder go all the way to then so that's what's gonna be happening nice uh, what is the event it's just gonna be this URL I think I'm pretty much all set to go here. It's on the right thing. Uh, it's on the right calendar. So let me go ahead and save that and see what that looks like in my calendar. Now I'm looking here at July 30th through August 5th, but let me change to my month view here. And I should start to see that in August. You can see all these guys are gonna show up there. That's great, I've got some other school events it looks like that are coming up. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get a notification for these. How do I get a notification? Well, let me go back and look at that event there. I'll grab this event here. I'm going to edit that. I could have done this when I set it all up there. I want to get a um, go go a little bit farther down here. You can see there's some other stuff. Notifications. Add a notification. I want to get a notification at the actual time. So I'm going to put a zero in there. And what kind of notification do I want? I could get a text maybe, or I'm going to do an email here. Let me get an email add a notification that's just going to email me at this address there uh, zero minutes that is when this thing occurs so let me go ahead and save that that's awesome save that and it's going to I want that to happen for all these events so every time this event occurs every time every week when I get one of these things happening I'm going to there they all are I'm going to get a notification of this sent to me in my email. Now, what does that notification look like? Here I am in my mail browser and I'm looking at one of those, a sample that I set up here. You can see it came from Google Calendar to me and this was the event. I'm going to go ahead and click on that event and then it takes me right to that web page. I might remember to go to that web page every morning, but if I don't, it's nice to have these reminders, these recurring reminders in my calendar and maybe even emailing me every morning to remind me that I need to go to that website. Hope that helps. Thanks.